We've got 10 speed and agility drills for you here today. These are great for football, uh, multiple sports, doesn't really matter because the principles apply, uh, but they're gonna work on your footwork, they're gonna work on helping you absorb and produce force, and really where we put these in our speed training is a simple uh, preparation period, so before we actually get to our speed work. So these are drills that would replace your footwork. I don't really like that term because it's pretty lame because uh, you know, athletes, you guys gotta move, all right? There's no sense in moving rapidly right where you're at, okay? But anyway, these, these ones are different. They're not ladder drills. Um, they're just ones you can use with two simple cones. All you need is two cones or a line, uh, and you don't even need those, honestly, because I'll explain the process of sets, reps, all that stuff at the end of the video. So I'm gonna get straight to it. Make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe, and check out the video. quick coaching point really quick all these drills are cool and stuff but the truth is that these are just appetizers for the real speed and agility work okay so a couple key points when you're doing these drills you want to do them with maximal effort okay that's number one two you want to have low hips and you don't want to be coming up and down vertically right because that's going to be slower for you so stay low stay wide and you also want to see you stay under control okay start slow doing the drills do like a walkthrough just like you guys do for practice and then speed up all right start slow speed up now back to the rest of the drill This is where we get out the questions of like how many sets do I do, how many reps do I do, all those little details and nuances, and we'll kind of share some of the principles in two seconds, but I just wanted you to understand this is the preparation work. This is going to help you just help you be more fluid with your hips, all right? Strengthen your ankles, your ligaments, your tendons so you can stop and change directions more rapidly for you guys, uh, really no matter what your sport you play, football, basketball, all those things. And then also you can combine drills with these, kind of like stack them. So again, this is not the end all be all, right? So you can do breaks, you know, straight ahead sprints out of here. You can do 45 degree cuts off some of these drills with the reaction with a partner with the tennis ball. So your creativity is really endless to what you can do. All right, you just gotta know what you're doing and have a system in order to help you get faster and progress the drills, okay? So this is exactly what we do with our athletes that we train here in our gym. So I hope this video has sparked some ideas for you. If it has, give me a thumbs up, really appreciate that. It helps the channel out a ton. And then also like, subscribe, and drop a comment down below. You have a friend that needs to do some of these drills, tag them in here, go hit the field with them. Catch you guys next time.